Hey everyone, what's up? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Lena and in today's video I will be cash stuffing $280 which comes from my bartending tips from this past weekend. So let me go ahead and quickly set up this money. Alright, and all my bills are really crispy, but I got some raggedy bills from the bar. I just did a bill exchange, so the money that's going back into the bank um, are those bills from the bar. And then I use the crispy bills for my cash stuffing. But anyway, this will be a pretty short video just because 280 is not a lot to work with. So after the cash stuffing, I do have a little bit of happy mail to show you guys. So let's get started with my green binder here. All right, we are going to be starting with daycare and daycare today is going to get $50. So 20, 40, and a 10. So now it has 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 550, 570, 590, and 600. So this is all set for um, May, but I will be cash stuffing um, a little bit just to get ahead of um, June. So household is going to be getting $5 and that is all that it has. LJ's Necessities also going to get five. That is all that he has. Capone, our dog, is also going to be getting five dollars. So Capone has 50, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, and 105. And then we are going to gifts, and this is going to get ten dollars actually. Um, let me do two fives. And um, this is for my girlfriend's birthday gift for this weekend i actually bought her a gift so um i'm just paying myself back at this point next is miscellaneous which is teacher appreciation gift this is going to get five so 20 40 60 70 75 and 80 and then annual expenses is also going to get five so 100 200 in the bank 20 40 60 65 70 so we have 270 for annual expenses that is everything for this binder let me know how you guys are doing while you're watching this whenever you're watching this i should say um how your day is going for me it is a monday um and yeah my day's okay so far um i am working well i went to the office but i came home but i'm just filming this before i go pick up my son so beauty um, only one envelope is going to get stuffed, and that's beauty, and beauty is going to get five. So we have 50, 55, 60, 61, 2, 3, 4, 5. So we have 65 in beauty. All right, so that is everything for this pink binder. Next, hopping into my taupe binder. Uh, starting out with my son's savings, he will be getting $5. So 100, 200, 300, and 305. And then my personal envelope, I am going to get five as well. So 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, and 80. And then we are jumping to mom. And she is going to get five. So 100, 120, 140, 150, 155, and 160. I am saving up for Mother's Day. And then parents, they are also going to get five. So 20, 40, 60, 65, and 70. And then last envelope is my son's birthday, and this is also going to get five. So we have 100, 120, 140, 150, and 155. And then school supplies and pictures, I think I am going to stop because it has $80 in there. And um, yeah, that will be for next for the next picture. All right, moving into my saving challenge and holiday binder. I'm starting out with this binder and then I'm gonna hop into my beige binder. But I'm skipping all the holidays except Christmas. So Christmas is going to be getting $10. And I'm gonna finish coloring the rainbow, um, um, the rainbow, <laughs> the reindeer. Each icon is 10. So that's the last of the reindeer, reindeer row. And then we'll have four icons left, which is $40. So now this challenge has 100, 120, 140, 160, 180, 190, and 200. Yay, 200. All right, and then moving along to the 2024 challenge. This is going to be getting 15 today, which is the number 15 right there. All 
All right, so now we have 1,000 in the bank, 100, 200, 220, 240, 260, 270, 280, 285, 290, 291, and 292. So 1,292. Okay, so starting, um, this is my first time doing this challenge by TS Budgets. Um, I'm going to be only adding $5 today because, again, I don't have a lot of money to work with. Okay. So that is all that it has. And this mat is like a glossy finish um, versus the mat for this envelope. It's like a matte mat. I like both. They're different, but you know, they're just different when you like feel them. But regardless, they're both matte. Um, all right, moving along to the monkey biz challenge. This is going to be getting 19 to finish this. So 10, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4. So it should have $80. So it has 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 76, 7, 8, 9, and 80. Yay, so $80. It does say $75, but it is $5 more. So this $80 will be going into um, the New York City trip in this binder. So let me take this envelope out. And because I am done with that challenge, I will be bringing in this Hello Kitty challenge from Jen over um, from Jen on a budget. So I will be scratching off a couple numbers just to see what we are cash stuffing next time. All right, so we have a 30. I was not expecting that, so I'm gonna stop there and we'll cash stuff 30 for next time. And then we have nothing for the dollar saving challenge because I actually didn't stuff my wallet today. Um, and my wallet is still pretty good from my last cash stuffing and I haven't, haven't really been spending money like that. Um, but moving along to this binder, we are going to jump to vet expenses and this is going to be getting $5. So 100, 200 in the bank, 10, 15, and 20. So 220. And then medical is going to get five. So 100, 200, 300 in the bank, and then five in cash. So we have 305. Oops. Next is car, and car is also going to get five. So 100, 200 in the bank, and then five, 10 in cash. So 210. Debt is going to get $10. Oops. So now it has 30. And then investments is also going to get 10. So 20, 40, 50, 60, and 70 in investments. Next is travel, and travel is going to get five. So 500, 600, 650, 655, and 660. So yeah, we have $660. And for the New York City trip, I don't wanna to touch travel because um, this will be for like an actual vacation, not like the mini getaway. And then miscellaneous, which is for the mini getaway, this is going to get 56 from my bartending gig. So we have 20, 40, 50, 5, and 6, and then the 80 from the savings challenge. All right, so let me add this all up here. It's a lot of bills, so <laughs> hopefully I don't mess up in counting. But we have 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, 420, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 6, 7, 8, 9, 61. So we have 461, I believe, so almost at 500. And then dream home or next home is going to be getting this last 20 here. So we have 500, 600 in the bank and then 20, so $620. All right, so that is it for the cash stuffing part of the video. Um, hopping into the happy mail part. So the brand Clever Fox reached out to me and they were kind enough to send me two items here. Um, I have heard of them before. Um, let me actually move this out the way. All right, so as I was saying, um, I have heard of the brand before Clever Fox um, for their like just planning planners. Um, but yeah, so I got a budget planner. This is the A5 size planner. It's undated, but it's 12 months. It's for budget planning, there's expense tracking, goals and strategy, debts and saving, holiday spending and bill tracking. So let me just open it up here. So it has a couple card slot, um, well, a couple more, but this, I'm not gonna take this out. And then a zipper pocket here where you can put, you know, pens or coins if you're gonna use this as a 
um, wallet planner, some sticker sheets here, and again, undated, they're all undated, so you have your monthly budget, some expense tracker, notes, pages, um, but yeah, for 12 months, and then at the very, very end here, they also included some budget sheets and some envelopes. I believe there's 12 envelopes. So if you're just starting out, I, I think this is like a really, really great planner for um, anyone that's starting out, starting to budget, um, you know, starting to expense track. So what I'm going to do is actually give this away to one of you guys. So if you guys are interested in um, winning this budget planner from Clever Fox, just leave me a any comment down below, followed by the hashtag budget planner. I'll leave it on the screen. So um, there's no confusion, but yeah, um, yeah, so just enter if you guys want to win this. It doesn't matter if you're like a beginner or, you know, not a beginner. If you want this, just enter to win. Second item I picked out was this travel um, planner pocket size. This is for my personal use, um, just because, you know, with trip planning, it really does take a lot <laughs> of research sometimes. So I really like how they have, you know, bucket lists, places, experience, cities, and then your trip planning, schedule, some calendar. This is also undated, but I love that it includes research, food, you know, your budget, emergency contacts. I will use this to some extent, but a lot of times I also use my notes um, on my phone to, you know, keep track of um, my travel. But I thought this was so neat and I love that it's like pocket size. So I will be using this. So thank you, thank you so much to Clever Fox. If you haven't heard of them, check out their website. I will have them linked down below. And then for budget planning, I do use a combination of paper planning as well as digital. Um, I have an Excel spreadsheet on my laptop just to keep the um, things easier. It's just easier for Excel, but then sometimes I also like to incorporate um, paper and pen. So I do carry a uh, planner with me at all times. Um, anyway, that is it for today's video, short and sweet, I hope. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and thank you so much for sticking around. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day, your night, your week, your weekend, whenever you're watching, and I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye.